Yeah, so this house over here is a small house that I designed and I'm building for a friend of mine who's from Los Angeles. And he actually is building this house with profits he made from Bitcoin. When he was down here after buying Bitcoin, back when it was pretty low, he had talked me into getting interested in it and I actually bought a bunch of Ripple actually back then and it was cost almost nothing then. And within a month, my uh, exchange that it was in got hacked and I lost all of it. It was only about $600, but that was worth about $40,000 now. So yeah, I've been really focused and thinking a lot about security. The guy that's doing it is an artist and it's designed basically to look sort of old fashioned, like an old farmhouse, but it's also very modern at the same time. The loft extends out over the porch. You have a great view to the north. The house is sloped at about 10 degrees facing south, which is perfect for solar power. Although in Costa Rica, we have the world's cleanest and greenest electric grid. So doing solar power here is not really as green as it would be in most other countries. So this is Ginger. She came to us, to the farm. She was completely skin and bone. She was almost dead. She had so many different diseases. She was on every kind of antibiotic that the vet had. And now she's a very happy dog and uh, one of the farm mascots here. Yeah, so I'd like to talk a little bit about the upcoming token sale. It's starting on October 12th, which is what, about three weeks now? So yeah, part of what we're doing right now is we're still interviewing people, a lot of incredible advice, advisors and potential advisors. I'm on the phone with people almost every day in meetings and people that are finding out about the project are getting really excited. You know, people know that this idea of mass adoption has been what people have been waiting for 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 years and waiting for it to happen and so far people are seeing that Divi is the best prospect so far and, and people want to be involved. People that missed out on Bitcoin and Ethereum are, are getting involved with this because they're saying that oh you know it this looks like the, it's gonna be the next big thing and I don't want to miss out. So I've been talking to some pretty amazing people who when I first talk to them on the phone I'm thinking I'm gonna have to convince them to join and they're already telling me they're they're in. They're safe things like, oh, you know, I just want to let you know I'm in, I want to do this, we can work out the details. And it's really fun to have that level of excitement. So one of the, really, we have quite a few great advisors. One of them is my friend Me known as Mez, Ramez Nam, and um, he's probably most famous for writing a incredible set of sci-fi books called The Nexus Trilogy, which I read, and I'm in. Last year he ended up winning the Philip K. Dick Award for the best sci-fi novel in the world um, for the third in the trilogy and I recommend that to everybody it's fantastic and um, he's basically as an, an advisor he's a very well-known futurist and he's traveling around the world every time I talk to him he's in a different country and people basically pay him just to come and talk to an audience in different different companies he's been at Google and all kinds of very big companies uh, talking about his ideas for the future and so we're very excited to have him aboard. Um, another one we have is a amazing human being named Tim Sanders. Tim Sanders was the chief solutions officer for Yahoo years ago and he wrote an incredible book called Love is the Killer App which is one of my favorite business books of all time and I had met him years ago so it was, for me it's really thrilling to be able to work with him because he's one of my business heroes and I, I loved his book so much I remember getting it, buying a copy and getting it at, autographed like a groupie at this business conference and so I never thought at that time that I would actually be working with him and so that's very exciting for me. Another amazing person we have is Michael Greenwood who I met when he was in his early 20s and I remember he was, he was just kind of a kid at the time and he had already got the, uh, the Ducati motorcycle account. It was really incredible. He showed me his stuff and, and that was years ago. He's only gotten better since then. So he's worked for Microsoft as a project manager doing user interface design and he's worked for several other quite amazing companies. So we're excited about him because we're talking about having the best UIX of any cryptocurrency. That's one of our big things with Divi. We want to have a type of wallet that everybody just absolutely loves using. 
I'm gonna put some links in the description on this video, so check those. You can see some of the amazing things that our team members are up to besides Divi. So about our blockchain, we have some people right now, we're basically mapping out how it's going to be structured, talking about the possibilities and trying to see how that can relate to our smart wallet. One thing that's important to us is we wanna be able to do things that nobody else can do. Because of course, if you do anything great, everyone's just gonna copy it. So we want to make sure that our blockchain can do things that others can't. It's not so easy for more established coins to change their blockchain and, and it involves a lot more work. So um, we want to basically start with having everything that we need in the blockchain and basically take a big leap ahead of existing blockchain technology. We also have a team that's working on what we call the MOCCI, M-O-C-C-I, that stands for Masternode One Click Cloud Install. And what we're doing is making it so that a masternode can be very, very easily. We don't know if it's really gonna be one click, but it'll be one or two clicks and people can basically choose the cloud hosting company of their choice and with a click or two, they'll be able to install a masternode. Right now, that's a very difficult process and an average person can't do it. Even with video instructions, things always go wrong. You basically end up having to call a, a geek friend and spend two hours on the phone going over it to try to get things trouble troubleshooted. So making that easy for people will be able to make it so that a lot of people are able to set up master nodes that otherwise wouldn't be able to do that. So be sure to subscribe because we're going to keep updating you. We're, it's part of our brand, I would say at Divi's, we want to have really good communication. I think one of the things we've been frustrated with ourselves as investors in other coins is seeing the very poor communication by the teams who are so focused on the technology and don't have very good people skills and we vowed not to cause that type of error and we want to make sure you guys are really kept, kept up to date so be sure to subscribe and find out more as we learn it. Thank you.